everyone. Ooh, bright light. Um, I hope you're all well. We're back with another what I wore in a week video. Sorry if you can hear um, traffic outside. I've got the windows open because it's quite warm today. Um, so today, Saturday and I'm going out for lunch. Well, it's not really lunch. It's more of a very very late lunch Our meals booked for like quarter to four or something, but it's quite early now It's it's just coming up to one and I'm going out with my mum dad and Tim It's my dad's birthday on Monday. So I booked a meal at San Carlo in Manchester So the weather has turned out really nice. It was so dull and cloudy this morning and it said it was going to be a little bit sunny and I was like, mm, will it really though? And it's turned out to be so lovely. So I'm just trying on outfits. I'm trying to decide what to wear um, because it's one of those things. It's like a daytime thing. So we'd probably be walking there. Um, so I kind of want to wear flat shoes, but also it's quite a nice restaurant. So I want to dress up a bit and it's quite warm too, but you never know when the cloud goes in, it's not always that warm. I'm just deciding about this dress. So this dress is from Sauna New York, of course, and these bed sandals, these are so, so comfortable, which is why I popped them on with this, and they're like a goldy metallic shade. They just go with absolutely everything, and um, really easy to walk in, and because of the metallic, they kind of dress the outfit up a bit. But I think this dress actually, the camera doesn't really do it justice. It's a really nice, kind of floaty, breezy dress, which, I love. I've got this kind of ruching detail at the neckline here. Nice puff sleeves, uh, it's beautiful fabric, beautiful quality, you know, a huge sauna uh, fan. And I've got my North School jewelry on. But yeah, I'm not 100% whether this is what I'm going to wear. Bag wise, I'd maybe put my Bottega with it. Goes quite well. Or my Demelier, I think the Bottega probably goes a little bit better. So yeah, this is my first option, but I might try something else on. So I'm angling slightly more towards this. It needs a steam, so I'll have to do that if I'm gonna wear it. So this Amazon drop dress, it's got like the kind of, what's this called? Peplum style hem. And then just sleeveless, really chic, really comfortable. Great for if you're going out for a meal because it's all black um, and nice and roomy and loose. So this is option number two. I think I'm getting slightly closer to a, to a decision. So this is my Karen Millen dress. It's a new in, um, I featured it on my reel. If you don't follow me on Instagram, it's at Lydia Jane Tomlinson. Um, I just did a reel with Karen Millen and this is one of the pieces in it. Now, I might keep these shoes on or I've got some kind of tan ones that I think would look quite nice, some tan strappy sandals. So, this is another option and I could just pop a blazer over my shoulders with this as well. Okay, so I think I've concluded on this. I've actually changed my sandals. Um, I thought these were a little bit lighter. So I got these in Mango years ago, but I'll try and find something similar. I know a brand called Tiki's, I think it's T-K-E-E-S, -E do some quite similar styles to these, like quite um, strappy, tan colored, um, and then I probably pop my Bottega bag and a blazer over my shoulders. So I'll go and try that on now. So I think I'll probably go for this blazer. It's from Weekend and Beyond. Just a really chic, easy, comfy look, this black dress. Such a nice one to just throw on. Um, I love the square neckline with this thin halter. I think that's really flattering. And these cutout details just provide something a little bit different. And the blazer for a bit of extra warmth. This blazer is such a good one. This one's from Marsala London. I think I got, I think I said Weekend and Beyond before, but this one is Marsala London. Such nice quality. You'll have seen me wearing this before, but yeah, it's just a nice summery one to throw over your shoulders if you just kind of want that little bit of extra warmth. Quick change of plan, I'm actually gonna go for my Chloe bag just because I think it ties in quite nicely with the muted kind of greeny tone of this blazer. I think it blends quite well. Oh, and I've got my Vela sunglasses on as well. Uh, they're like a greeny shade as well. So all kind of tonal and matching and then the black dress. 
everyone so it's the next day now we had such a lovely meal yesterday at San Carlo um, I had a tortellini and we had garlic bread and Tim tried oysters for the first time I did not attempt to try them but he said they were good so yeah that was that had a really nice day it's now Sunday it's Sunday midday we've just had some brunch and we've decided to go for a walk in Tatton Park which is like, if you don't know it, it's a really nice National Trust Park and it's got a hall, Tatton Hall, like they've got a few nice little shops, little food shops, things like that, gift shops. So we're going to walk through Tatton Park I think. It's in a village in Cheshire called Nutsford so I'll show you what I'm wearing for our little walk. So this is what I've got on, just kind of casual. I've got my um, new Zara top on. Just like this kind of peasant blousey thing and then my mango gilet which i really like it's got these kind of padded shoulder things um my Cezanne trousers not trousers the uh, jeans which are kind of like the same color as the top like a creamy off-white jean and i've just rolled them up at hem and then i've got some really old mango trainers on because we'll be walking it's quite a long walk so i just wanted to be really comfortable but i think this outfit would actually look really nice with some sandals but i don't think the trainers not go don't not go these socks are not the most convenient but they make them more comfortable so yeah this is what i'm wearing probably take a little bag with me i'm not sure which one um, and i'll try and get some little clips for when we're out and about everyone I thought I'd very quickly show you my very casual Monday look I'm actually just nipping out to the shop and I needed to throw something on so I've got this trench coat from Sana on this top I can't remember where it's from it's like a grey sweatshirt my Align jeans which I love Zara tan sandals and a huge Cezanne bag because I'm going to the shop so using it just as like my reusable shopping bag so this is just my casual monday look i thought i'd show you very quickly because it's not that exciting hello everyone it is tuesday today and it's such a lovely sunny day actually yeah gorgeous day actually so i'm on my way out i'm meeting freya to go to harvey nichols for this They've kind of opened a new thing, I think, on their food floor. So we're just going to bob down and have a bit of something to eat, a bit of a catch up. And then I'll probably come back here and we're meant to be going to the Oast house later to watch the England game. So that should be quite fun. As of now, it's like 20 to 12, I think. I'm metering at 12. So I thought I'd show you the outfit. So I've not actually decided on a bag yet, but this is the look. So I'm wearing this top. This is by Marsala London. It is beautiful. I think it's actually meant to be a shacket as well, so you can wear it open. Um, and then I've paired it with this pretty lavish skirt. So this is like my knit go-to for summer. It's such a good piece. I also have the very light creamy colour and these colours just work so well together. They're like a kind of sagey beige. Um, so slight, slight green tinge. It's quite a warm beige. And then my new sandals from Russell and Bromley. The Knotty sandals. 100% go up a size. I've gone up a full size and as you can see they fit me in the way that they should. Um, so definitely go up a size in those. They're so, so comfortable as well. Jewelry wise, I'm wearing my Habibti earrings from my collection with North Skull and, and also my rings and bracelets are also from my collection. So yeah, this is the look. I might pop my Demelier bag with it, but I think it's time um, that I go and meet Freya.
Super quick outfit of the day. I'm in a bit of a rush actually. I'm trying to beat the traffic. I'm um, going back to see my mum and dad. And this is what I'm wearing. It's quite a bo balm balmy? balmy warm day outside. So I thought I'd just throw this dress on. This one is such an easy throw on and go dress. I absolutely love it. It's the H&M one and I got this in a large. Um, I did initially get it in the small, but it was too form fitting and I just wanted something really easy and loose. I'm very tempted to actually get this. They do it in a beige and oh, like a slightly stony off white and I'm very tempted by another color in this because it's just so, so useful. It's got the split hem here, it's so comfortable. It's not too dressy, but it just gives something a bit extra with the button detail. Sandals, I've got my mango chunkies on my Demelier bag and YSL Sunny, so it's just a quick outfit of the day, very casual. Hi everyone, so it's the next day now. I think it's just gone half three, 20 to four on a Thursday afternoon and it's such a lovely afternoon that I was kind of desperate to finish everything I needed to do at my laptop so that I could go and sit on our rooftop and sit in the sun for a bit. But my intention is to um, take my notebook up there and kind of um, plan all of next week. Um, I really like to get ahead with my content in terms of like writing all the outfits down from the videos that I want to do um, so that when it comes to filming the videos I'm not all flustered trying to find different outfits and I've got it all written in front of me. So that is the plan for when I get up there. This is what I'm wearing, it's just this really gorgeous sauna dress that I showed at the beginning of this video. Just such an easy one easy breezy throw on dress. I've got my mango chunky sandals with it which just which just dresses it right down. Just got my hair up, my YSL sunglasses because my makeup under here is not so chic and my North School rattan plait hoop earrings which are just so nice for summer. Just a little hint of um, some jewellery and I'm taking my Loewe basket up as well with my bits and bobs. So yeah, this is what I'm wearing. everyone so it's now Friday afternoon I've got the windows open so if you can hear outdoor noise that is why um, this is what I'm wearing I'm just heading out to m and I need to get a few bits um, we're actually going out we've got two garden parties in a row like evening garden parties um, so we've got one tonight and then one tomorrow night so I probably well hopefully will show you what I'm wearing for that later on I don't know what to wear actually with it being outdoors um, something warm but this is what I'm wearing now just heading out I've got this Everlane knit on it's like quite a lightweight I think it's cashmere but it's quite lightweight collared knit um, these trousers are from Weekend and Beyond. Such a nice, casual, comfy style just to throw on. They kind of make everything a little bit more chic. My Oasis sandals and Cezanne basket bag. actually completely ready but this is maybe what I'm wearing. <laughs> Finding it really hard to dress for outdoor weather in the evening when it's a sunny day but then it goes cold at night. So this is what I've got on at the minute. So these are pretty lavish trousers, it's like a white trouser and then just my strappy Aloha heels. Knit is by Everlane um, as I had on before. And then I put my hoop earrings and I think I'll go for a bit of a stronger red lip. I've actually lost my belt, my black belt. I need to find that. I think this is what I'm going with. Hi everyone, I hope you're all well. So it's now Monday and 
basically over the weekend because we were at my mum and dad's house um, I didn't do filming of the outfits they're actually having a new kitchen so everything is kind of a bit turned upside down at the minute so I couldn't really film I ended up not wearing the outfit that um, I was wearing I wore these jeans actually these are just some old high-waisted ones from Zara and I wore these with my new mango top it's like I checked kind of top but it is actually sold out now I think everywhere it was in sale now it's sold out so I doubt it would be coming back so if I'd worn it you probably wouldn't be able to shop it anyway but really cute check top and then some old Zara heels and then we went out the following night again it was more of an evening like outdoor barbecue-y kind of thing and I wore um, some jeans, trainers, a blazer and a white t-shirt so you've not really missed out on some crazy exciting outfits. But yeah we're back to Monday now and I think this is going to be my final outfit of this video. It's just my casual working from home outfit. I wanted to kind of start looking a bit nicer and feeling a bit nicer for when I'm just sat at my desk. It's just gone lunchtime now um, and I've done all my filming for the morning so when I'm filming I obviously have one outfit on and then the afternoons I usually spend doing more admin -y type work um, and yeah I just wanted to start making a bit more of an effort to feel like I'm at the desk working and a bit more productive rather than just wearing my usual joggers so I've just got this casual this is my Arquette t-shirt on just basic white t-shirt and then I just thought I'd pop this with it it's from Sandro um, and I think it's part of their like smiley collection or something. I've also got the big canvas bag to go with it. So cute. And also a really cute um, shorts and shirt set. They're like a matching set and it's all very colourful and cute. Um, but it's just felt like it's Monday. I wanted a bit of cheer and this cardigan really provides that. It's just so cute. I love the pockets on it. It feels gorgeous quality, of course. It's from Sandro, so yeah, beautiful quality. I love the buttons on it. And then on the back, it says, smile, smile, we love joy. How cute is that? I just think it's so nice to pop something like this on. You know, just with some jeans, just got my slippers on. Tim got me these last year. I think they're from, where are these slippers from? I can't remember. Sheepskin sheep skin something. Just sheepskin or I don't know. Plain white t-shirt. And then just to throw this cardigan on, it jazzes it up a little bit and I feel like I've made a little bit more of an effort. Just puts you in a more productive mindset, I feel. So yeah, this is my final look. I hope you've enjoyed this video. Um, I'm really enjoying filming these at the minute, so there might be more to come actually. We're going on holiday soon, so there might be a few, a couple of, well, a week and a half maybe where there are no videos, but I'll be picking these what I wore videos up again, definitely. I don't think I'll do one on holiday just because I feel like I really need a clear cut break for a bit. No cameras, no filming. Um, as much as I kind of want to film my outfits on holiday because I know they'll be useful, I just feel like mentally I really need that break. So what I thought I might do for holiday outfits is film them afterwards in a bit of a kind of haul showing you in detail kind of resort holiday style outfits. So that is a bit of a plan. Anyway, let me know if you enjoyed it by giving it a like or even better, giving me a comment and telling me if you want any more of these to come in future or anything else you'd like to see from me. Don't forget, hit that subscribe button if you haven't already and you've been enjoying my videos, um, then please press the subscribe button because I'd very much appreciate it and I'll see you in my next video hopefully. Bye!